Hey guys, what's up? It's Amstricken06 of Amstricken06.com and today we're going to be working on the 2016 Kia Sorento but this video works for any car in the world and I really mean that. So I wax my car a couple times a year and I typically use a paste wax. Paste wax basically is a sponge with some caked in grease inside and the problem is it's going to leave white traces all over the black plastic trim. Now they're very difficult to get rid of you can buff it till you want, you can heat it up, you can rub it with alcohol, you'll probably end up fading out the black plastic, but I found a simple, cheap solution that I'll have linked down below, pencil erasers. No, really, pencil erasers. They work like magic. It's absolutely insane. Let me show you. Take a look. So we're working on the right rear, which means passenger side, wheel well. Lots of traces of paste wax. So you're gonna take your simple, white, gummy style eraser, and begin to scrub it. Along the traces of wax. And just brush off the rubber eraser. Check it out, it's gone. Let's go ahead and rub off this area here. And then just take a little rag to remove some of the rubber eraser uh, sediment. Now, as you wear the eraser, it's gonna begin to round off the edges. You can save the sharp area of the back of the eraser for some of the harder to reach areas, like this. You can take the point and just rub the areas. They're a little bit difficult to reach. So save the back of the eraser for those hard to reach areas. Take a look at that, it's gone. So here's a pretty obvious spot. This is on the rear of the vehicle. We're gonna head and take our eraser and just begin to remove the paste wax that otherwise is a total pain in the rear end to remove. Look at that, pretty cool, right? There's another spot. I know a lot of guys that use painter's tape and they spend like a good half hour taping up the plastic on the car. There's really no reason for it. When you can come back in and within seconds just remove it. Let's move you right over this way. Again, just take your eraser, run it along the wax, and brush it off. Here's some real stubborn areas. This is the first time I ever bought the car. I brought it home. The following weekend, I clay barred it and waxed it. So this has been sitting on for about like nine, 10 months. So we're gonna take our eraser, run it along. Look at that. Old wax, gone. I don't know about you guys, but if I wax a car, I want this thing looking spotless. Doesn't matter if it's a Kia or a beat up old Chevy. If I put elbow grease into it, I don't want people to dismiss all my hard work and look at some white stains. All right, guys, so I hope you learned something new today. I'm going to link these specific rubber erasers in the description box down below. These specific ones don't leave any kind of red or white markings on the black trim. And also in the description box below is going to be a link to my website, amstricken06.com, my Instagram, amstricken06, or hashtag amstricken06, as well as the car forum that I now run, greasemonkeyforum.com. But Check out the description box down below. Bunch of different links to different products and camera gear that I use. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you like my content, please give me a subscribe button hit. Definitely helps me out. I'll see you guys in the next video. It's I'm Stricken, and I'm out.